My name is Susan Freed and I'm a teacher at Cypress High School. I teach five sections of human anatomy. I attended on an October in-service, a TED Talk introduction, and I brought that back to my classroom right away because I realized how TED Talks really fits into the five C's. Uh, unlike my spring TED Talks, I um, do this one in a forum of either three, four, or five group members, and it really forces them to go outside the box and meet someone new within the classroom. They have to learn how to manage who's speaking, and they also have to create their own voice. It's not just one person dominating the whole speech and the whole outlook of everything. It's all of the students working together to create this project. They get to present it uh, live on our live stream through Mr. Delgado's class. So in the beginning, we started off with a document and then we started talking more on our separate group chats. We just all got in a group together and it was just really exciting in general to be able to work with like other people. You have to communicate with the world and with the people in the world they need to look for jobs and those jobs mostly involve communication because without talking and like collaborating with other people you can't get anything done. The five C's are critical for every student to have um, as a basis before they leave high school into the real world because every job is going to ask them to communicate and work well with others. By me getting an opportunity to kind of introduce this to them in my class, I feel like they have a one-up and then they can go on into whatever role they're going to go to. So I teach students with mild to moderate disabilities. Some of them have hearing impairments and what I really want them to do is to be able to have an opinion have reasons for that opinion, understand why people might have a different opinion, either through writing or through speaking. Since we started the Catella Talks and the TED Talks, I've worked really hard to get the kids to talk more. I use a walker to help me get around in store. It takes me longer to get to class on time. I wish people would be more aware of me and understand how hard it is for me to walk. We use the Teach FX, we started Socratic seminars. I want the kids to talk and I want the kids to have a voice, so I also try to find material that's relevant for them. We work in groups, uh, take turns on talking, and listen carefully to each person. You get to communicate better with someone, um, understand them better. A lot of times these kids with learning disabilities don't get a chance to say what they want to say, so I want to make sure that they have that ability because it's going to serve them very well later in life.